sure how many turns the song shows. <laughs> but I dig it. I um I just want to let you guys know that your sophomore and junior years are not all going to be terrible. I don't know <laughs> why why we're trying to scare you tonight. But uh, you know, you know a joke's gone bad when Steve's the only one laughing. <laughs> but um I'm kidding, Steve. I love you. Well, I, I see that we have a, a pretty much young crowd, and I, I'm going to go ahead and assume that you're, you're all still into partying and all that. But that, that will fade. Um, and it's funny because the memories that will cause that to fade don't actually don't exist. It'll be the nights you don't remember that'll make you over partying. Um, I, I remember when I was starting out, I was, I was kind of into showing alcohol EDU that I really could hold my alcohol. <laughs> Like they gave me a number, and I was like trying to beat it. Um, and uh, you know, it's it just it gets old after a while. After after you get to the point where your liver's so messed up that you get a hangover after using mouthwash. Uh, I don't I don't know what it is about alcohol. Like uh, maybe it's the fact that that parties here, you know, pay about eight dollars for the gallon or something. But there, there's some kind of strange form of uranium in it. And it's, <laughs> You know, it just brings out the food in people. <laughs> so kind of, kind of over pissed and sober. You know. um, I was talking to a friend of mine about acting, and I brought up some some actor I didn't like, and he went, "Oh my god!" Like, you know what? You don't even know. You don't even know. Like, I love Ashton Kutcher. I've got news for this guy. He doesn't know Ashton Kutcher. He doesn't know any celebrity. Like, Ashton Kutcher is notable in our vocabulary. We are not notable in his vocabulary. We do not know him at all. Like, for all we know, any celebrity in Hollywood just has some weird things that would not make us want to be friends with them. Maybe Ashton Kutcher has an acquired taste for baby fetuses. I don't know. I don't... <laughs> well, actually, he landed to me more, so I guess to me more. To me more as a acquired taste for baby fees too. <laughs> Costco. <laughs> but no. Really, Ruth? Really? <laughs> that made you sigh. <laughs> Alright, well that, that means I got toned down. But I'm serious, like I don't know, something about celebrities. I, I feel like they're just we, we, we raise them up so much that like they're just so perfect in our eyes that we don't really want to know the truth. Um and I don't know how this reminds me of deep yesterday, but they pissed me off, so that's gonna come up. <laughs> how many of you ride bikes on campus? Oh wow. Okay, to the rest of you, I'm so sorry for almost running you over <laughs> at one point in your, in your time here. But there are certain intersections that are like wide enough to where we could have like 60 bikers go through, and there's still that one DPS officer who's pissed he didn't make it somewhere higher. And he's got, he's got the glass that say, anytime I tell someone to do something, it's the top part of my day. And he tells me to get off the bike. And it made me get late, uh, made me be late to class. And I thought to myself, you know, what if something terrible had happened? What if that couple seconds would have been the difference between like me getting hit by a car or me running over something, like a baby fetus? Like, I, I don't know, like maybe there's a delivery truck in front of me and a bunch of baby fetuses on it. Like, Ashton Kutcher was ordering takeout. Don't, don't be too appalled. I'm not saying that they were hoarded. Maybe they were stolen. It's just, I don't, oh, you're, that is an awkward face, my friend. Are, are you on a date? Because like, you just, you just did the whole, oh, I don't approve of this. So. I know that face, my friend. <laughs> anyway, I'm trying to reconnect with my exes. Um, I'm not sure why, but I'm told that's what you do when you're a good person. And um, I flew back home because uh, that's where my last ex was. And we went out for frozen yogurt. And, you know, I, I should have known that maybe it would bring up some old feelings, but we went in and she saw our favorite flavor and just started falling. Because her favorite flavor is California tart. And when we broke up, it was because I moved to California. So even though it was like great for me to like have a new world, it was bittersweet. So I was that California tart. And it was like, you know, really, it warmed my heart. And it, it reminded me of when uh, we broke up the second time. And I went, out, I went out for yogurt, and they had my favorite flavor, overbearing psycho bitch. <laughs> Delicious. 
<laughs> I am. Um, I'm one of those people that you can convince to go clubbing, but I'm not gonna have a good time. Like, just rubbing up against anyone is weird. And uh, that's not part of the joke. That's that's something you know about me now. Um, <laughs> no, I, I remember I was 18 when I first went clubbing, and it was just this. I want to say a Latin club. I don't. I don't want to be racist, but it was like like old school Latin, like like. <laughs> like there, were, there was a guy on the stage playing an accordion. That's that's old school Latin club. And I agreed to go to it. And I mean, it was 21 plus, so we, we had to lie to the bouncer. And I I remember what the story we told him and and why it makes it so clear that bouncing is not a difficult job to get because. We told him I didn't have my ID because my house burned down. <laughs> like an, a, a serial arsonist had hit my very medium income family. You know? and, and the funny thing about it is that like, he didn't think at all about what I would do after somebody burns my house down. Like, why would I go clubbing? <laughs> Don't you think I'd be a little bit wary of like roofs on fire? Like, <laughs> Where am I gonna take this chick? My rubble? <laughs> Thank you guys so much. You've been great. Woo! Yes, yes. No, we're not. Let's go. Woo! Yeah. Yeah. Don't don't cheat the band now. Shit, they got a laugh there, damn man.